Hey everybody, it's Luke over at Galaxy Tech Review, and today I'm going to review a product from Decal. This is the P4 Mini Bedside Table Bluetooth Speaker with RGB Lighting. You can check it out on Amazon at the time of this review for $29. I'll have that link in the description below where you guys can check it out. Is this speaker worth putting on your bedside table? Well, we're going to dig into it now and check it out, and I'll be right back. Let's quickly go over some of the specs of the P4. This has an RGB LED light in it as well as a speaker and a microphone so you'll be able to take phone calls with it. You're going to see that it is a one a 5 watt speaker so don't expect insane amounts of sound but if you have this on your bedside table you shouldn't have any problems at all. Now it does have a Bluetooth version 5.0 supporting A2DP, AVRCP, HFP, and HSP profiles. That normal 10 meter uh, wireless Bluetooth range that we normally see. It does have an aux input for a 3.5 millimeter stereo jack uh, and it does have a micro SD card slot uh, with a built-in battery of 2000 milliamps which is great uh, it'll give you up to eight hours of playback time and it'll give you up to 15 hours if you're just using it as a light so those are the quick specs on this Take a quick look at everything that comes inside the box. You're going to get a charge cable, which is a standard USB to micro USB charge cable. I'm glad that it's standardized. Uh, you will be able to recharge the battery in this, or you can just leave it hooked up uh, to any uh, AC uh, to USB adapter that you might have lying around uh, once for your phone or your tablet will work. Uh, so you don't even have to worry about the battery. But again, you're going to get uh, up to eight hours of uh, audio playback and up to 15 hours of a light usage out of this uh, for the LED light. Now, they do give you a, a user guide here for the P4 ambient light and a few things about warranty. We're not going to go into those. Uh, we're going to look at build quality. On the bottom, you're going to see this is an anodized aluminum on the bottom. This isn't plastic uh, with a really nice ring on the bottom to keep it in place. Uh, Decal did a great job on that. Uh, so I like the aesthetics of it. Uh, the top half is going to be a plastic, uh, but that's to allow the light to shine through. Uh, and it does a pretty good job. So not bad on the build quality. On the back, you're going to have a dedicated on-off power switch, your micro USB uh, input for charging the uh, internal battery, a micro SD card slot will take up to 32 gigabyte cards, and an aux input for devices that don't have Bluetooth. You can hook those up right here. On the top, you're going to have a touch plate here, and this will change the lights. Uh, you're going to have a built-in microphone, uh, also your uh, volume up and volume down buttons, which are your track forward and track reverse buttons, a play pause button, as well as a mode button on the right-hand side, as you can see, denoted by the circle. So overall, uh, pretty nice and easily laid out. Uh, I like the, the way that this is set up. Now, just turning this on, uh, I'm going to turn the lights down a little bit here so that you guys can get an idea of what the uh, LED light function looks like. Uh, and then we'll go into a quick sound test on this as well. So let's take a look. Uh, if you tap it, it's just going to have three levels of brightness. Uh, and this is your normal bedtime lighting. Uh, it also has RGB effects, uh, different colors uh, that we'll go into in just a second as well. Uh, so you do have this. This is really nice uh, for your bedside table, having three different brightnesses here. Uh, and as you can go through them, if you long press this, uh, you'll get into the colors as well, which I'll go over. Uh, you've got this color here, which is kind of like a sky blue. Uh, and then you will, uh, of course, have other colors that you can cycle through, uh, kind of a darker blue, uh, a green here, uh, a purple. You also have uh, other ones if you mistakenly long press it, you have to long press to get back into it again. Uh, yellow, red, uh, and you get to cycle all the colors at the end here, uh, which is kind of like uh, this uh, breathing effect, which I like a lot on this as well. So let's get into a sound test and pairing on this uh, just to kind of show you guys uh, what the deal is with that. Okay, so pairing up this device is pretty simple. Once it's powered on, doesn't really matter what LED mode you're in. You're just going to go to Bluetooth and you're going to scan for the device itself. And it's going to come up as the decal P4, really self-explanatory. Uh, and this, again, runs on Bluetooth 5.0. If you're concerned, it is backwards compatible with older uh, Bluetooth, such as you know 4.2 and, and even lower than that. So it will work with all of those. But it does have some benefits to uh, you know the newest 
uh, Bluetooth uh, 5.0 that's built in. So we're connected for call and media audio. Again, I did some test calls on this uh, and it worked out pretty well, but let's do a sound test real quick so you guys can hear the sound on this. So there you go, that's the sound test on this. I think they did a pretty good job for such a small speaker, uh, but you guys can be the judge on that one. Okay, so that's my review of the Decal P4 Mini Bluetooth speaker with RGB lighting. Again, you can pick it up for $29 on Amazon. I'll have that link in the description below. Uh, overall, for the price, I think this is a pretty decent bedside table. Uh, type of setup. Uh, you've got a lot of really good lighting uh, touch control effects. Uh, the fact that you can use it as a speakerphone as well to pick up calls if you're in bed, that's pretty cool. And the sound is okay. It's not uh, mind-blowing, but it does pretty good for a single 5-watt speaker. It has a little tiny bit of bass to it, but not too bad overall. For the price point, I definitely give it a thumbs up. This was Luke from Galaxy Tech Review. Remember to like, and if you guys haven't subscribed yet, please do so because that always helps me out. And I'll check you guys out on the next video.